dear students in this video i am going to cover the next topic of our this syllabus first we see our syllabus up to this ms of ms what we have covered we have completed so now from fifth number onwards we have to see the practicals now you can see this here the major topic is, is ms access create a database in ms access to store the patient information and the second the second one is and the next one is here you can see this sixth one is also is in ms access and you can see this seventh one is also generating report and printing the report from patient database which page, uh, which database patient database it is related to fifth one now you can see this here is also creating invoice table using ms access number nine is also in ms access number 10 is also ms access from fifth onwards from here to here total six topics are there six topics six practicals we are going to cover in ms access only so before we go uh, before we go practical we should know about the data database and the ms access data database and ms access fifth one is patient information with all required fields using with all required what is patient information what are the required fields here you can see this these are the basic required field of patient information name date of birth gender address city state zip email id etc now we go for data and database so now we have to see what is data in simple words data means information data can be information related to any object it means it it is just it is an information for example your name age height address and some data related to any object to any person like picture image file word documents can also be considered as data so you can so now we have an idea about what is data next we have to see the database management what is database a system at a database is a systematic collection of data it means whenever we require anything whenever we store any data it we have to collect in a systematic manner and we have to enter in a systematic one manner it, that is known as database so here it says this next point it clears it makes what are the usage of database it makes data management easy so that it can be easily accessed managed and update here you can see this you can complete this topic here in this add modify delete and the patient record the same thing here is this it can be easily access managed and update computer databases next point what is ms access microsoft access is one part of ms office it is a database management system that combines the relational microsoft and it is a graphical inter user interface and stores the data in its own format every software their own policies do a wide variety of other format it means it is a unique and it is a common software which understand different formats with in with the help of ms access we can import data from other databases also like example you can export and import data from word processing file spreadsheet spreadsheets means ms excel and other data bases come to the next points there are four main steps to process to use ms access it means before we use 
Microsoft database, we have to create the data, we have to enter the data, we have to generate query and we have to, if required, we need to create a report. So what is database creation? Create your, your Microsoft Access database and specific what kind of data you will be storing. And what is the second word? Data import. Once you create database, you have to enter the data daily basis. And the next one is whenever we require something, whenever we, you want something about the specific object, you have to enter, enter, you have to search and you will get and you will get the information. What is report? Report is used for presentation. It is an organized, nice presentation that can be printed in an access report. Information from the database is organized in a nice presentation. And the next one is MS Access uses objects to help offer you tables, tools, micros, and everything. Database is access. Here you can see this. What it says? Tables, queries, form, reports. Now you can see this. How many things are going to be covered in this uh, access form? A report, table, storage, queries. This all everything we are going to cover in a single software only. So be careful. Be repeat. Uh, be careful. Now you please read and write each and everything carefully. So now the, the second question is what is table? Table means table is an object which stores data in a row and column format to store the data. It means table has two things. What is table? I will show you. Here you can see this. table has what it says. Table ha is an object which stores data row and column data in a row and column format. Here is a column. This part is known as columns. This three part is known as rows. Here is you can, for example, serial number, name, which row. We have we have entered the data in a row. Here is the column, serial number one and two. Here is the column. So a table is usually related to other tables in database. It means whenever we require, whenever we do something, whenever we have created different tables, so we can interconnect with each other. Each column must have unique ID, like your roll number, like your unique ID number. With the help of unique ID number, we can get the data easily within different, uh, in different objects, in different, like if we are in table, we can get the, uh, get the query, query information, we can get the report information, we can get the forms information like that. Now the question is about query. Queries answer a question by selecting and sorting and filtering databases. Query means it is a kind of filtration. It means if I am in need of anybody, if I am in need of any object information, just I have to type that unique ID. Then I will get an answer with the help of query. Query shows a selection of data based on criteria limitation you provide. So we can give inf limitation in, qu uh, in query. The, the thing is what I have said just now, type of query can be select, insert, update and delete. So we can delete anything at any time. There is no need to worry about that. And the thing is form. A form is a database object that can that you can use to create a user interface for a database application. Form helps you to display live data from the tables. 
it means uh, whenever uh, whenever i am going to perform a practical i'll tell you what is life data what is, what are the things form will help you to how it looks like and the next thing is one is report a report is an object in the stock database primarily used for formatting calculating printing and summarizing selected data the main of the main work of report is printing and calculating printing and calculating if we are in need of something we have to present the data with the help of report object we can we can print the data you can even customize the reports look and feel it means we can customize we can design the report we can design we can design the report and all thank now i am going to finish my talk my video here is the some advantages of ms access access offer a fully functional relational database management system in minutes easy to import data from multiple sources into access you can easily customize access according to personal and company needs access works well with many of the development so here are the some advantages of ms access you can write this thing if you have any doubts let me know i will clear your thoughts okay thank you very much